I'm Amy from Body Fit by Amy, and this is your upper arm flab attack workout. So in this workout, we're gonna keep it short, we're just using some dumbbells, and we're gonna be targeting those upper arm muscles where, especially as women, we tend to get a little flabby and we always want to tighten and tone. So just a reminder, we can't spot train, meaning you can't just work one muscle and expect to see results. We wanna make sure that we're working the full body, we're getting cardio, and we're getting a healthy diet. But in this workout, we're gonna really make sure that we hit those muscles hard. Okay, all you need is a set of dumbbells. I'm going a little lighter, I'm going fives. I just had a baby a couple months ago, so I'm just getting back into getting strong. So I'm gonna keep it a little lighter, but certainly it's up to you what you wanna use if you wanna go a little lighter or a little heavier. All right, so, we're not gonna get a warm up, we're gonna keep this short, so get a warm up on your own if you need it. So we're gonna start with just a little tricep kickback. So I'm gonna show you from the side, we're gonna roll those shoulders back, knees are soft, flat back down, we're gonna keep the elbows up, and then we're pushing up to the ceiling. So here we go, join me here, we're pushing up and down. So what we don't wanna be doing is swinging those muscles, and we don't want biceps coming up this way, we're gonna go triceps to the back. So really extending up, your elbows stay high, you're pushing those dumbbells up to the ceiling, keeping the back flat, keeping the knees soft and slightly bent, and we're here, almost there. We've got about 10 seconds, we're gonna go through everything once, and then go through it again to really make sure we feel it. Hold it here, and we're just gonna go little pulses, up, so barely lifting. Should feel a good little burn already, I know I do. Woo, yeah. Also, we're working our backs this way, so we're getting a little bonus, upper back, mid back, and shoulders. Squeezing here. Almost there, 10 seconds. Breathe for four, three, two. So bring it up to a standing position, but keep them here, and you're just gonna bring those hands together. So here and back. Squeeze in the back of those arms. So again, we're targeting upper arms. Lots of things are working, so you'll feel your shoulders and your back as well, but squeeze behind. Here we go. We got 10 seconds. We're keeping everything short. Keep breathing for four, three, two, and one, good, shake those out, nice work team. Let's go ahead and bring those dumbbells up over our head. Elbows are staying in, and we're going down behind the head. So overhead extension, we're here. Making sure that we're not arching our back, so if you're here and you feel like you're arching, go ahead and put one foot back. That's gonna help you. So extending, and also making sure that those elbows aren't getting out to the side. We wanna keep them in close to our ears. Watch your hair, I just got mine. There we go. We got five seconds. Four, three, two. So hold it down at the bottom. I know you're feeling it. And we're gonna go out and in. Out and in. You should feel the burn in the back of the arms. Oh yeah, I know I am. I know it's a little bit of a weird motion. Taking it out to the side. Keep it low, so I know we wanna go up here, but let's keep it behind the head. Out and in. Out and in, burn. Woo, five seconds, you can do it. And breathe and relax, tap it out. So we're gonna go through all of that again while we rest those triceps. Let's just get a little cardio and abs and biceps. So we're just gonna alternate our curls. So working the front of those arms is just as important for that upper arm flab as the back of the arms. I know we all wanna target the triceps, but we can't ignore the biceps. Bringing the knees up is engaging our abs and also getting our heart rate up. So again, like I was just saying, you can't just spot train. we would be working a lot of muscles and getting our heart rates up, burning those calories, and a healthy diet as well, right? So we're gonna keep this just a few more. Good. Last two. Last one each way. And relax. Okay, so tap it out. We're gonna go through all of that again. We remember, kick back, pushing straight up, behind our back, over our head, out and in. 
So starting with that kickback, roll those shoulders back, knees are soft, flat back down, bring the elbows up. Remember, we're pushing to the ceiling, we're not swinging, and we're not doing biceps, we're going here. Here we go. Push and up. One more time through. We're only doing 30 seconds each exercise, so we can do this, guys. Really tightening and toning and getting stronger in those upper arms. We're halfway there. 15 seconds to go. Flat back. Here we go. Push to the ceiling. Elbows high. Four. Three. Two. Hold it up, straight arms down and up. Down and up. Little slower and then we're gonna pulse it. Here we go. Little pulses, little lifts. Very controlled, not swinging. You can do this. Keep breathing. We got about 10 seconds. Squeeze in the back of those arms. Woo, yeah, I feel it. Here we go, four, three, Two, relax. Let's take them behind. Squeeze behind your body. Squeeze, try to make them touch. There we go. Squeeze back of the arms, also back and shoulders. Good work, team. You got this. I already feel my arms getting stronger. 10 seconds. Breathe. Yes. Three, two, and one. Let's take them up over our head, okay. Together, up and over. Here we go, elbows in. So arms are close to those ears. If you wanna lock those fingers, if you can. Remember, we're not out here yet. We're keeping them in close. If you feel like you're arching your back, put one foot back. There we go. Yes, 10 seconds to go. And then we got one more exercise. You got this, guys. Three, two, hold it down, out and in. Again, I know this is a weird exercise. It looks kind of silly, but you feel those triceps, right? Keep those dumbbells behind your head. Not here, we're not here. Keep them down, out and in. Woo! Yes, so close. 10 seconds. And breathe. Four, three, two. Bring them down one more time. I know. I didn't tell you we were gonna do those biceps, but we gotta get them in. We're getting biceps, front of the arms, abs with the knees, a little bit of cardio, but I promise this is the last thing. You did it. Whew, so close. You're gonna feel those arms tomorrow. If you keep up with this and your other workouts, you're just gonna get tighter and fitter. For women, we don't get big bulky muscles. We, even if you go heavy weights, trust me, we don't have the testosterone to do it, but you can get smaller as you tighten and build that muscle fiber. Here we go, five seconds. Three, two, one. Excellent, drop those dumbbells down. Quick little stretch to the front. Woo! Yeah, arms, hopefully we feel this tomorrow. And up to the top, big stretch. Woo! Let me go ahead and drop one arm behind your head. Just push back gently, sort of right in front of that elbow. Try not to be right on the joint. And other side. If you need more of a cool down, get it on your own. Big deep breath in and out. And that was your upper arm flab attack workout. Great job, everybody.